Hello friends, welcome back to Infigam. Today in this video, we have one very, very interesting question from functional equation. f of x plus 2 over x minus 2 equal to x square plus 4x plus 4 over 8x. Given that x cannot be 0, x cannot be 2, f is mapped real to real with x. So let's get started by considering method of substitution here. I will put this bracket equal to t. So I am going to write LHS FT. So we need to know x as a function of t for our RHS. So let us find out. I will write x plus 2 over x minus 2 equal to t. This is our substitution. Now we can cross multiply. x plus 2 will be equal to x minus 2 times t. Or I can write x plus 2 equal to xt minus 2t. Now we can take minus 2t to the LHS and x to the RHS and write 2t plus 2 equal to xt minus x. Now 2 is common in left hand side so we can write 2 times t plus 1 and x is common from right hand side. So we will write t minus 1 in the bracket. Now by dividing t minus 1 both sides, we will find x as a function of t, which will be 2 times t plus 1 over t minus 1. And this x we are going to plug in in our RHS which is not going to be that easy. So what I will do here, I will calculate 1 over x from here. So consider reciprocal both sides. We will flip numerator and denominator. We will write t minus 1 over 2 times t plus 1. So this is the value of 1 over x. Here we have x. Now we have to simplify our RHS first. So we can split our numerator terms with respect to denominator. Let me write here. So I will write x square plus 4x plus 4 over 8x will be equal to x square over 8x plus 4x over 8x plus 4 over 8x. Now 4x over 8x. So we can write this is half. Here 4 over 8. This is half. So x is in the denominator also. Here we will cancel x with denominator x. So I can write this value will be equal to x over 8 plus 1 over 2 plus 1 over 2x. Now we can write x over 8 plus 1 over 2x which we will write 1 over 2 times 1 over x this term and then we have half. Now we have x and 1 over x ready in terms of t. So x is 2 times t plus 1 over t minus 1. 1 over x will be t minus 1 over 2 times t plus 1. We will apply these values here. So I will write x over 8. 2 times t plus 1 over 8 times t minus 1. Plus half 1 over x is t minus 1 over 2 times t plus 1. And then we will write one constant half. Now 2 over 8 is 4. So we will get 4 in the denominator here. Here 2 times 2 is 4. Let me write f of t equal to I will write t plus 1 
over 4 times t minus 1. This is our first term. Second term is t minus 1 over 4 times t plus 1. And then we have half. Now I will multiply here t plus 1 in the denominator and in the numerator. Here we will multiply t minus 1 in the denominator and in the numerator. So we are going to get 4 times t minus 1 times t plus 1 in the denominator for our first two terms. Once we will use difference of two squares formula, we can write easily 4 times t square minus 1. So let us make our third denominator equal to 4 times t square minus 1. I need to multiply here with 2 times t square minus 1 in the denominator. So in the numerator, 2 times t square minus 1. Now I am going to write our common denominator. 4 times t square minus 1 and in numerator we will be writing t plus 1 whole square plus t minus 1 whole square plus 2 times t square minus 1. Now we can use a plus b whole square formula and a minus b whole square formula here. So we can write t square plus 2t plus 1. Now t minus 1 whole square will be t square minus 2t plus 1. And then we will be writing 2 times t square minus 2. And in denominator 4 times t square minus 1. Now plus 2t minus 2t will be over. 1 plus 1 is 2 which will cancel minus 2. t square plus t square plus 2t square will give us 4t square in the numerator and denominator is 4 times t square minus 1. This is equal to f of t. Now 4 and 4 will be over. We are going to write ft equal to t square over t square minus 1. Now we have to only change the variable t to x. Let me write here f of t equal to t square over t square minus 1. Now we will change variable t into x. So I will write f of x will be equal to x square over x square minus 1. So our answer is fx equal to x square over x square minus 1. Here x cannot be equal to plus minus 1. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.